Hello, future CIS students. My name is Allie Kreiber, and I just recently completed the CIS 112 course, just a few hours ago, actually. Um, and I, I'm really glad I took the course, and I think that you're going to find that you um, are going to be really glad that you took it as well. So I'm an engineer, um, so you, I guess you could say that writing and speaking isn't exactly my forte, but it is something I enjoy. It's something that I do work really hard at. And I like CIS so much because it really had both of those aspects of writing um, and also speaking so heavily into the course that I, I learned a whole lot about it and I think it definitely made me a better writer and a better speaker overall. So I hope that, you know, even if you think that your major or whatever degree you're heading toward isn't really going to require you to, you to do much speaking or writing, you still are going to have to do some at some point in your college career and definitely in your professional career. So don't write it off and really take the class and, and learn a lot from it because there is so much that you can learn. Also, I think my favorite part definitely would have to be um, service learning. Um, I went with Girls on the Run, and I loved every second of it, even on days they didn't want to run, which is most days, but that's okay because Girls on the Run, regardless of the name, is much more than running. Um, every day we would have to teach the girls some kind of lesson about different types of values of you know, how to portray themselves and how to treat others and take care of themselves. So it was, it was really great, and those are things that I really highly value. So I like I love sharing my experiences and trying to be a positive role model for the girls. And it's definitely something I want to keep doing. And I hope to be involved next next fall and in the spring and hopefully as long as I can. Um, the hardest part about the course would definitely have to be the TED Talk, and that's probably what everyone's going to tell you. Um, but I think it's harder for different reasons than most people. I'm not that afraid to speak in front of people. It, it is kind of scary, especially since I went first on the very first day. Um, but I think the biggest part, the biggest thing about it is I just didn't think there was enough time. There was so much information I wanted to share, um, and I just felt like I couldn't, and I felt rushed, and I wish I could, you know, I could have said everything that I wanted to, but, you know, there just really wasn't enough time. Six to eight minutes, I mean, it doesn't, it does, seems like forever, but it, it's not, I promise. And I, I think that you'll find that um, it's a lot harder to stand or eight than it is to get to six. So just keep that in mind and also prepare. Prepare a lot for it. Because going on the first day, I didn't get as much time to prepare as I would have liked. But um, it's really important. So make sure you don't take it lightly and you work really hard and make it the best presentation that you can. My biggest piece of advice I could give to you would, would definitely be to stay organized. There's lots of little assignments and lots of due dates. So make sure you um, get those done and get those done on time. And also get them done well. And there's tons of, all the assignments are, you know, pretty tiny. But they add up, not just point-wise, but also they're working toward your bigger assignments. So the better that you do them and the more involved you can be with them, the better they're going to turn, your big assignments are going to turn out. So make sure you do that and don't procrastinate because they will all build up on you and it'll be really challenging to get it all done. So my big picture lesson I, I want to leave you with is um, what I think I learned, you know, was the biggest lesson for me in CS, which didn't really have to do as much of the course, but um, I learned that you should let your passion lead you. And that might sound kind of cliche, but it's absolutely completely true. I was so passionate about my topic and about what I was doing that everything else just fell so naturally. Um, so find something that inspires you and, you know, that you can really stand behind. And everything, you know, will just come so much easier, I, I promise. And it'll help you not just in this class, but in your professional career and all throughout your life. So I hope that you find something that inspires you and, you know, that you can be passionate about. And just go with it. And you'll do amazing things and have lots of success. So I wish you the best, and I hope you like CIS, and have a great day. Bye.